Madam Speaker, I am informed by the Mauritius Examination Syndicate that in regard to the SC School Certificate GCO level examinations 2018, 1,868 candidates have obtained only three credits, 1,471 candidates have obtained four credits, and 5,627 candidates have obtained five or more credits. Madam Speaker, as regard Part D of the question, I'm informed by the MES that the number of students having scored at least one distinction is 4,019. Can the, can the Honorable Minister inform the House the measures she has taken to improve the results? Madam Speaker, every year after the results are proclaimed, there are reports that are obtained from the, Mauritius, from the Cambridge Examination Syndicate and the MES, along with representatives from the CIE, Cambridge uh, Examination Syndicate, along with educators and heads of department, carry out workshop and analyze the results and try to work out how best they can improve the teaching learning process. Can the Honourable Minister inform the House how many students will not be able to pursue HSC and how many has been left out? Madam Speaker, students having, this year, students having obtained four credits have been allowed to move on to HSC. Now, students who have not been able, if I go by the, the answer that I've just given, candidates who did not obtain the four credits, candidates with three credits, we have 1,868 who are being asked to repeat or to take another password. Can the Honorable Minister inform the House whether there has been a closed and proper study for the following up of those students? Madam Speaker, when students do not obtain the four credits, they are asked to go and sit for the exams again after one year. Students who still do not manage to get the required uh, to meet the criteria to move on to grade 12, grade 11, these students can take, go to different pathways. We have the MITD, we have the Polytechnics, we've got a number of other institutions, Fashion Design Institute, and a number of others who can absorb the students. 